But what an effort from the unguided. There is no doubt. What? Where the hell did that come from? Matt Vandergriff. Did Vandergriff get knocked out and not realize he wasn't in the match anymore? Was that just instinct? Of, he felt somebody coming? That's the only thing I could think of, but Matt Vandergriff. What the hell has gone into Vandergriff? Damian Drake's been back for a little over two weeks. I cannot believe what I have just seen. These two guys who claim to be closer than brothers. The reason for this is just not something I don't, I don't think I can comprehend. Like why, 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 why did he do this? Like what led to this? They just lost a match. And Matt was the one that was pinned. Matt Vandegriff, a man who has gone to the top of the mountain without Damian Drake. Maybe he just snapped after he just lost a match with his partner. He, he snapped, but we need some kind of reason here. What the hell? All right, Matt. The time has come, just like me and everybody here, we want to know why. Why, why, why? You were my brother. I loved you like my own. I brought you into my house. My family treated you like own. And you were the first person I introduced Ashley to. So I'm not leaving until you come out here and confess. I heard you mention that I was like a brother to you. We were family, best friends. You introduced me to your girlfriend, Ashley, who I could care less about. Now, Damien, there's one thing in this business you need to know. Friendship is nothing more than an illusion, which is why it's lonely at the top, and I'm not afraid to be alone, which is why I never needed you. You shut your phone off so we can have our moment here because I'm going to keep on keeping on doing what I'm doing and I'm going to keep kicking you in the face until you finally get it. Let's get one thing straight. If it wasn't for me, if it wasn't for Jay, if it wasn't for Lacey and Allison, you would still be flippy shit Matt Vandergriff. <laughs> So you are going to confess and tell me why.
Well, what's Vanderrift going to say? Obviously, Drake and Vandegrift respected each other's abilities, but hatred has changed everything! And right now, Damian Drake just firing away at Matt Vandegrift as 15 guys are having a problem. When it takes that many bodies to hold two people apart, it tells you exactly what you need to know about how far this issue has come. And I don't know if there is a way to settle things between these two at this point. Well, at some point, you gotta get one of them out of here. At some point, you gotta get one of them out of this area, out of the building. And it is unbelievable how these two men have imploded and where they are at right at this moment. In just a short month, they went from best friends to this. And Matt Vandergriff, he's inflating everybody. Vandergriff takes out everybody. Pile goes down. And they are gonna escort him out. That's the only way to do it. Yeah, like I said, you gotta get one of them out of the building. That's the only way you're gonna stop him from fighting. For now, they know where each other lives. And it looks like the pandemonium has calmed down a little bit here inside the FSW arena. Well, now, now they're finally taking Vandy Griffith out of the building. And they are hushed silence. Well, I mean, you remember the, the reaction of the reunion on October 9th. That was only a month ago. Of course, there's going to be hushed silence with two people so beloved. November 27th. Damian Drake, Matt Vandergriff, in a weapons steel cage match. <laughs> Unguided warfare! I'll tell you what, Jake, a lot of action happening today. Another steel cage match. Oh! Oh! Things aren't done! And Vandegrift, he snuck around the back. Even getting Vandegrift out of the building wasn't enough to stop what's, get, what, what's going on between these two. But on November 27th, live on Fight TV, there will be no escape for either man. They will be locked inside of a steel cage. All weapons legal. Unguided warfare. Vandegrift, Drake, live on Fight. 